shopping can be daunting when you're a new mother, but once you get the hang of it, it is so convenient and there are so many benefits for you and your baby. So in today's video, I'm going to talk to you about why I love it, how to do it, and show you four different baby carriers. And before we jump into the video, if you're new to my channel, hello, my name is Emily, and I'm a mum of three, and I post three different videos a week on a Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 7pm. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, I would love for you to subscribe and stick around. So anyway, baby wearing has been around for centuries, and women all over the world will wear their babies so that they can get stuff done. That's the biggest benefit for me, is that I have my hands free and once you become a pro at it you can even nurse your baby in secret. I actually found baby wearing because my first son was very windy and suffered from reflux so it was good to have him upright as much as possible. Other benefits are that it's great for bonding and even dad or other family members can wear babies as well. By having your baby at such close proximity to you as well, it actually helps you produce the hormones that you need to boost your milk supply. There are also loads of physiological benefits to you and your baby in baby wearing and they are less likely to develop flathead. Studies have also shown that babies that are worn cry up to 43% less than other babies and if you think about it, it kind of makes sense because They've been inside your tummy for nine months, so they are very used to being jiggled about inside there, hearing your voice, hearing your heart, and being nice and warm. So once they're born and we stick them into a buggy or a cot or on a play mat, it's a little bit different for them. But whereas if they're in the sling, it kind of mimics the womb. They can hear your heart, hear your voice, they're nice and close to you. It even helps them to regulate their own temperature. So there are so many benefits for them and they can feel more secure, I think, in the wrap. Yeah, so as you can see, I'm a big lover of baby wearing, but I never actually thought I would be. I kind of thought that baby wearing was for mums that are a bit more like hippie than myself, but it's so convenient and it doesn't mean that you have to wear your baby all day long, just whenever it's convenient. But I did find it so easy in the early days, the hours definitely added up. But anyway, I will now get on and show you my favourite wraps and the four different ways that you can wear your baby. Right, so the first type of wrap that I wanted to show you is my absolute favorite type of wrap for a newborn baby, but it's also the most daunting, because when I got this massive, long piece of material, I was like, how on earth am I going to learn how to do this? They all do come with instructions, though. This is the AMA wrap, and I really like it because it is cotton. It's really, really soft and stretchy and easy to use, but I don't think it really matters what brand you have, as long as it is one long piece of material. I promise, once you get the hang of it, you will be able to put this on so so quickly all you have to do is find the center and they are normally marked with like a seam or a badge like this one is and you want to match that up to your belly button so you just put the wrap like that around you take it around cross it over like this and bring it up over your shoulders like so then you're left with these two really long bits like that over each shoulder so what you want to do then is just cross them over like this and then tuck them through the band. So you kind of put them through and make sure they are crossed like this. And then all you have to do is take it around the back and you can either tie it right there around the back or I like to bring it to the front and tie it there. And that is literally it. Yes, so then you'll look like this and then to get your baby in, you want to put one of their legs into the cross that is closest to you. So the cross on the inside. Stick one leg through there first then stick their other leg through on the other side and then use that band around your waist to bring it up around their back. I used to like to tuck their head under one of the crosses as well so that they are really, really secure and close to you. The next type of baby carrier I'm gonna show you is perfect for when your baby is six months plus and they are able to have good head control. They want a bit more stimulation. They wanna look around a bit more. Um, so this one I actually bought on Amazon. It is called the Eco Sussy, but I don't think it really matters. Baby Bjorn looks very similar to this as well. All you have to do to put this one on, it's super, super simple. You just put it over your head like this, you put it through there, and then you have what's left like this. And then there are two buckles around the back. Bring it round to under the leg and clip it. And then again, on the other side, bring it around and clip it. And that's it. All you have to do then is put your baby into the middle and then you can either have the front part underneath their arms 
or over their arms, either way. Yeah, and the best thing about this carrier is you can wear it three different ways. You can have your baby forward facing so that they can see out and see lots of things. I only really like to do this for about 10, 15 minutes or so, and if I think my baby is tired, I will face them towards me because then they always have the option of resting their head on my shoulder. So as I said, you can wear them towards you as well, and you can even wear this type of baby carrier on your back, which my husband likes to do, so then they can have a little ride along piggyback as well. Yeah, so those two ways that I just showed you are my personal favorite ways of wearing my baby. The next two I'm gonna show you I like less, but I know some people get on really well with these ways, so I thought I would show them in this video anyway. Yeah, so the next baby carrier that I'm gonna show you is a ring sling. As I mentioned, I actually liked this less. I feel like it is a little bit less secure, and when you put a newborn in it, I didn't feel very, very safe that their airways and everything were as safe as it was in the first wrap that I showed you. But I know lots of people get the hang of it. It's super simple to put on. All you have to do is stick it over your shoulder like this, and then you can put your baby into this part. I think this would suit a baby from six months plus though, especially on those days when they're really teething and you cannot put them down. You could carry them around in this, or you could even carry a much older child in this. I tried it out with my three-year-old, and he seemed to quite enjoy it, and it definitely helped to distribute his weight. Yeah, so basically, once your baby is in the wrap, you will want to pull all the material, any slack that is around, and then adjust the ring, and then that is basically all you have to do. The fourth way of baby wearing that I'm gonna show you, I personally think is absolutely ridiculous, but I found it on Amazon, and I really want to show you all the different ways that you can wear your baby, and who knows, this could suit someone, even though for me, I think it kind of defeats the point. Basically, this is from Angel Care, and it is like a seat that you put around your hips like this, and there is Velcro and also a buckle that you do up. And you wear it like this, and then you put your baby's bottom on this little seat. So the idea is that it really helps to distribute their weight, and a baby could go on this from about six to seven months, but in the instructions when you get it, it does say to never take both hands off of your baby. So for me, the biggest benefit of baby wearing is the fact that you can have your hands free. So if this does not allow me to have my hands free, I kind of think, what's the point? Yeah, but anyway, I thought this was quite funny, so I wanted to show you. Let me know what you think in the comments below. It even comes with this little purse so that you can put your money in it. It's basically like a massive bum bag. Right, so that is it for this video. I really hope you found it helpful, and I'm actually gonna give away all of the baby wraps that you've seen in this video to one of my subscribers. Now, this isn't sponsored or branded at, at all. I just wanna give something back to you guys. So, if you want to win these for yourself or for a friend that you know is pregnant, all you have to do is like this video, make sure you're subscribed to my channel, and comment down below why you would like to have them, and I will announce a winner on the 30th of June, 2017. So yes, comment away and I will make sure that I announce a winner and send it out to you and get in touch. But yes, good luck and again, thanks for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye! <laughs>